Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Vape of All Trades. Today I'm here at the Bukit Mera area and I've arrived outside the office of SLP Scotia and that is where my good friend SK works at. SLP Scotia is a real estate company and I've known SK for a couple of years now and he's like a really steady guy. Every time we show him, he's always free for us. So while I know he works hard, he also can party very hard. And I've always wondered why. So today I'm going to be finding out what he really does for a living. So let's go meet him. SK as a friend personally, I hang out with him, so I know him as a friend but I prior to this I didn't know how he actually worked. Okay, so SK tell us why do you want to be a property agent? Oh, um, real estate is my passion. Mm -hmm. I love networking, I yeah. love meeting different people in my daily life. Yep, and also looking at nice houses. Yes, absolutely. Okay, so today SK is going to be giving me a crash course on how to be a property agent. So what do I have to learn today? Okay, we will be doing project marketing mm -hmm. and preparation for house building okay. followed by speaking to potential buyer. Wow, that's a lot to learn. Okay, so let's get started. Sure, let's go. Okay, so SK and I are here at Sims Urban Oasis yeah. and the show flat is super huge. But for now, I'm very impressed with this show flat model because as you can see, there are even like tiny, fake people in the show flat. So I'm very impressed. Okay, so for the first thing, yeah. if, uh, you learn to become a property agent. Right. You must learn how to break the eyes to the buyer. The second thing is, yes. um, what I usually do yeah. is when the buyer's walk in, I yeah. greet them, right. introduce myself. Yes. Okay, then I get, take a project brochure, yeah. I hang out to them. Right. Okay, so thirdly, which yeah. is the most important aspect. Right. Okay, you have to engage small talk with the buyer. Small talk, okay. Yeah, so ask some questions. Yeah. Uh, so you learn how to listen more. Then right. you understand their needs. Right. I'm going to go try. Yes. You go help me. I will step in when, when you require any assistance. Steady. If I close how? Then, okay, fine, I'll treat you a buffet. Buffet only! <laughs> <laughs> So when the couple came into the show flat and FK was like, oh, go, 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 you know, now's your chance to put your training into use. And I was very excited. And then I was like, chung to go and meet them. After that, then talking, talking halfway. And then I realised, damn, I forgot the brochure. <laughs> Which was one of the like three main points that I had to remember. And then I had to like, you know, ask SK to go like, hey, give me the brochure, give me the brochure. Very, very pricey. He taught me a lot of things. Making the buyer feel comfortable is very important and I saw how SK engaged in small talk with them and asked them, you know, very simple, open-ended questions that, you know, they cannot not answer. So that was very good. Alright, so we're here at Sentosa Cove in front of this super giant house and SK is going to be showing me how to present the house to a potential buyer. Wow, damn! Wow! Wow! wow. So when I first got to uh, Sentosa Cove, before that I've only seen the houses from the outside. I haven't really been in one and seen how you know it looks from the inside or seen the view. Okay, so we're here in the master bedroom. So SK is going to sell it to me. Okay, first of all, uh, sometimes it's good to know the measurement from one point to the other point. Uh huh. Yeah, because uh, you might have clients that like to customize their own bed size. Right, like a round revolving water bed. Okay, so imagine this. Oh, my client next. Yeah. Okay, let's walk out to your own uh, balcony. Wow! Come. You can uh, have your meat, bring you a breakfast, have your <laughs> breakfast down here. <laughs> this is how you should be yeah. enjoying life. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's open up. My vocab, sorry guys, my vocab is very, very limited today because wow is all I can say. Well, I can already imagine my bags, yes, all your my jewellery, yeah, all your my jewelry. like calves. Yes. Okay, what is this? Wow! Your own dressing table. Yep. I can put all my makeup here, my hair products here. Yes. <laughs> I'm selling the house to myself. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I have to walk through my bags and clothes to get to the toilet. Yep. Wow! <laughs> Dude, look at this. Check out the rain shower. You're literally showering by the sea. How can anyone not buy it? Wow! Wow, this one's terrible. No balcony. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow! Yeah. Wow! 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 Dude, 
it looks like an infinity room. What is this? I've never seen a room like that with just glass. It's so scary. Okay, look at this. Dry kitchen. Two ovens, I can like bake two things at one time. Oh my god, even more ovens. <laughs> Why are there so many ovens? Who is baking so much? Is it Master Stewart is buying this house? <laughs> I cannot afford this house, so the correct question would be if I'm the agent who sold a house like this, who okay. sells a house like this, how much do I make? Yeah, okay, you yeah. Cannot tell you guys, but let me just say that I want to be a property agent right now. Okay, so I think um, being a property agent, it's very awesome because there is no um, ceiling to your salary. You can make however much you can sell. If you can sell like a $15 million house, you can make like, you know, a significant amount from that lah. I actually have a prospect buyer coming. Are okay. you ready to show it to him? <gasps> show him? Yeah, and he wants to buy. to him, yes. I don't have a freaking brochure <laughs> for this place. No, you, you will just do it like how just now. Huh, but what if it's like a $50, $50, $50 million deal? No, don't worry. And I blow it. Everything starts from the first time. And he actually my friend. Oh, oh ah. okay lah. So if I blew it, not that bad. Yeah. Oh, stress, yeah. Stress, Sorry? stress, stress. Oh dear. Hi. Good to see you. Hi, I'm KK. Hi, Hi CJ. Okay. CJ, okay. Come this way, please. Okay, CJ, I will show you the view of this place. This is the third floor, as you can see. Yeah, so you can imagine how this place can be at night if you invite your friends over for, I don't know, a cigar or a barbecue. Now look at the view and enjoy this. And you can park your own um, yacht in your backyard. Okay, so there are five bedrooms on this floor. So we'll start with the master bedroom. Okay, so you have a balcony here as well where you can I don't know, have your breakfast here in the morning, have your helper bring out your breakfast, you can eat with your wife and your children while looking out here at your yacht is soon to be here. Okay, so FK told me not to bullshit the buyer because you know, all these high net worth people, right, you cannot uh, smoke them, you have to, you know, give them facts and tell it to them factually. So I was just like, okay, this is the bedroom, <laughs> this is the toilet, <laughs> this is the wardrobe. The SK after that cup, you can tell me, is it, hey, they're not blind for your alcohol, your whiskey bottles. So this is the wine cellar. And here we have the wet kitchen. Does your wife cook? Uh, once in a while. Once in a while. She will cook more often in this house. Hey, how come this kitchen got no stove? Ah? What's the stove? Oh, oh, it's so high tech, I didn't even know. Okay, I guess this is the stove. I saw for myself how SK um, dealt with bias, how he talks to his team and how he, you know, makes them laugh. He's always making a joke and making everyone feel comfortable around him, regardless of whether it's the crew or myself or the team or even potential buyers. So everyone is always very comfortable to be around him and I think that's why he has so many friends and, you know, important friends and he has such a good network. Yeah. And in a business like this, connections are very important. Very shy, around 2.4. <laughs> okay, um, good thing is uh, yeah. for SRP Scotia, yeah. uh, every Friday we actually have a mini hangout, party. Oh, okay. Actually for you to network and also bond together with your clients oh, yeah. and also with your fellow agents, yeah. like your teammates and all this. Right. Okay, let's go for drinks. So I'm here at the place where the SLP Scotia agents have weekend drinks. SK is already inside with his friends. I'm going to go look for him in a bit. And this wraps up this episode of Bit for Ball Trades. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe and leave a comment on what we can do next. And I'll see you guys next time for the next episode. Bye-bye!